So normal skin is a layman term which basically means problem free skin. I don't like the term so much as a dermatologist because it doesn't mean your skin is abnormal if it's oily, if it's dry. So, but basically uh, it's a general term used to describe skin that is problem free, that is neither too oily or too dry. So dry skin is basically skin which after bathing it feels very, very tight sometimes can be itchy sometimes can get irritated and usually even if you don't apply anything for a number of hours uh, it will still remain dry and probably will eventually get uh, a bit red or painful or scratchy it's unable to produce natural oils to moisturize itself so oily skin is skin that is generally able to moisturize itself and above that it still produces even more oil which sometimes can be found to be a nuisance by the person who has this type of skin so you can keep wiping off the oil and the oil still keeps producing itself so the term sensitive skin is basically used to mean skin that gets easily irritated irritation can occur either due to application of products it can occur due to change of weather it can occur due to uh, change in the environment so basically sensitive skin is neither dry nor oily even though uh, people with dry skin tend to have more sensitive skin. Anyone can have sensitive skin. You can also have sensitive oily skin, sensitive combination skin, or sensitive dry skin. Combination skin is a term used to describe skin which has a mix of areas which are dry and areas which are oily. So what usually happens is if you look at your face, this area that's uh, across the forehead, and down to your mouth what uh, is generally called the t-zone that tends to be the area that produces the most seborrheic um, uh, sebum so for people who produce a lot in that area but the rest of the face is dry that's what we call combination skin <laughs>